Good Thursday evening, Southeast Texas. This evening's shower and thunderstorm activity winding down across the area. However, it'll be back coming up tomorrow with a generous chance. Lower chances are expected this weekend, but they're not zero. And then it looks like by the middle to latter part of next week, high pressure will build in. And that means hot, humid, dry weather conditions. Uh, scattered uh, showers and storms are expected coming up tomorrow. Highs lower 90s with triple digit heat indices once again. Our forecast for tomorrow, again, about a 50% coverage, 20 to 30% coverage over the weekend. We've had to raise chances on Monday with a 30% coverage. And uh, compared to yesterday's forecast, we're also going to up rain chances on Tuesday. This is because the high is not moving in as quickly as what modeling is showing yesterday. But we still get the high to build on in to ensure a hot, dry, humid forecast the middle to latter part of next week and the following weekend. Trough of low pressure across East Texas, the deepest moisture off towards our southwest, but we still have hefty amounts of uh, moisture in the atmosphere across the area, as you can see. And that uh, interaction between those two or three items helped to produce the uh, numerous showers and thunderstorms. The trough moves out. We get a little bit of drying coming up on Saturday, but we're also going to have to watch the orientation of this high because the, the uh, high builds we get kind of a slide. So we may see some disturbances trying to come in on this side of the high and interact with this moisture coming up on Monday. So that's why I'm going to go with a 20 to 30 percent coverage. Then after that, sayonara as the high builds on in, kicks the, the moisture out, and it looks like dusty, hot, humid, and dry across the area in the middle latter part of next week. So rain ending tonight. We'll see decreasing cloudiness, some patchy fog possible overnight with lows in the low to mid 70s. Then tomorrow, about a 40, maybe 50 percent coverage as the sea breeze works in off the Gulf of Mexico in the afternoon. On the Gulf of Mexico, slightly choppy seas around two feet in your coastal marine forecast tomorrow. We'll see south winds at five to ten knots, water temperature 89. Our forecast tonight, rain's winding down. Lows will be in the low to mid 70s, some patchy fog possible. And then tomorrow, we'll go with an even 50 percent coverage. It'll be hot, humid and dry with highs in the lower 90s in the south to southeast wind. After Friday, again, lower chances. We have had to raise chances on Saturday. I had a 20% coverage yesterday, but the moisture is not moving out as quickly as what we saw yesterday. Highs rebounded to the mid 90s Monday and Tuesday. And again, because the ridge of high pressure is slower in moving in, we've raised chances just a bit higher uh, Monday and Tuesday. And then after that, high pressure takes hold and that will certainly warm us into the mid 90s here in the triangle, probably the upper 90s as we finish out next week and head into the following weekend on a dry note. Download our app, follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and as always, there's more weather at 12newsnow.com.